they want me to be a gold digger so bad. They want it so badly. Mm -hmm. And like, it's just couldn't be further from the truth. What's been the most challenging and surprising thing about pregnancy so far? And what's been the one thing that you've had to get used to the most with this new body? I will say, and this is probably not what you're going to think. I didn't start showing until I was about six months Okay. because I am just a naturally thin person. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I think finally it's a, it's fun to be in a phase where I definitely look pregnant. Um, there are so many times that I would just tell people I'm expecting and they're like, where, like, where's that baby? No, you're <laughs> not like, like almost like, the, like I had to prove something Yeah. and you know, almost speaking of sports illustrated that's that's almost like a form of body shaming i'm sure, like no you're right your your expectation of how my pregnancy mm -hmm. should look or how i'm supposed to carry is not my responsibility so i think the most surprising thing is the amount of people that are like no oh, you're not where's that baby i'm like i swear to you i'm pregnant you also did the netflix documentary and then you kind of let people into your world a little bit more and yeah. i think you saw in an interview that like Maybe you weren't exactly thrilled with the narrative and maybe how the edit was. No. What was it about it that you really just did not like? You know, I don't think that they, you know, they had a narrative. You know how reality TV yes, works. They have a narrative mm -hmm. and they push that storyline. They, I just didn't feel that they made me like look like they didn't show me who I really am. Like I work very hard. Like I have my, I make my own income. I am independent. It just looked like I'm sitting here staring at like the pool where we were shooting, but it just looked like I, I just prayed around in my bikini all day. And that was just such a small amount of time that we shot. And we were kind of naive to it. And they were like, oh, you know, let's get a shot of you and the dog in the pool. That I was like, oh, that seems innocent enough. So I was like, yeah, I'll go throw on a bait. I put on a one, one swim bathing suit. Cause that's part of my brand. Yeah. And I, yeah, they were like, did the close up on my ass and I'm like, God, there's so much more to me than all that. But you know, it, it could have been worse. Right. It could have <laughs> been <could've> worse. worse. <laughs> yeah. I mean, what would you say like after people watch that, would you say what was maybe the biggest misconception about your relationship or yourself that you really wanted to clear up? Oh, maybe that I'm just like not supportive, but people take one look at me and they, they want to, they want me to be a gold digger so bad. They want it so badly. Mm -hmm. And like, it's just couldn't be further from the truth. I've, I've, I've never quit working. I've, I work even harder now that we're, you know, married. I, I, there, I have so many irons in the fire. Like, like it annoys me to no end that just because I have this personality and I share my life on Instagram and I travel with him and we do extravagant things. Mm -hmm. It just, they just want, they just, they judge a book by its cover and that could not be further from the case. For more news content and exclusive interviews, make sure to hit the sub, like, and bell button down below and visit usmagazine.com.